students uh, this is our j menu j menu bar j menu item program so the class name is j menu menu bar menu item implements action is now we know this line so this is the constructor in this these four uh, these lines are already known lines uh. so j menu bar j menu bar class is used to create a menu bar j menu bar contains menus menus contains menu items so j menu the, uh, in this j menu bar each uh, application program contains only one j menu bar means one menu bar in that menu bar we are creating so j menu j menu bar constructor no parameter for the j menu bar constructor this is the empty so we can also give a name to the j menu bar but here we are not uh, giving any name j menu j file we are creating a first menu in j menu bar so that is with the help of j menu file file is our first menu okay so we know that like this look here so this is the j menu bar and file so just like this these are the file editor format view help these are the menus just like these menus we are creating menus by using our program j menu file means a file menu will be created okay so the name of the menu is file under the file menu we are creating items so by using j menu item okay so the object for the first item is jm i open because it is related to open we are creating open menu item by using j menu item open okay so just like for example we have file so open so this is the open menu item so this is not our output i am showing uh, a sample example so i will also show our output regarding our program so then i am so this open menu item is saved in jm i open object of the j menu item class then we are creating save menu item just like open so for saving in jm i save so j menu item constructor in this way we create a uh, open save close and exit menu items okay so then we are adding these menu items so first we are adding jm i open we are adding open menu item to the jm file means file jm file is the file object jm j menu object so we are adding jm i open to the file menu okay then we are adding jm i save item to the file menu then we are adding jm i close item to the file menu okay so in this way we are adding after adding all the menu items so we are adding file to the menu bar by using jm that add jm file okay we are adding file menu to the menu bar so this is the menu bar and we are adding file menu okay then j menu jm options so op so we are creating other option uh, we are creating other menu so that is the options menu by using j menu constructor okay so again in that options menu we are creating sub menus so the first sub menu in options is colors again in order to create sub menus also we use j menu constructor colors is the sub menu in the options main menu okay so then we are adding items to the colors okay colors menu so red we are adding red item to the colors sorry we, uh, we are creating red item by using j menu item then green item by using j menu item we are saving green in jmi green then blue in jmi blue then we are then we add uh, all the items to the colors uh, menu so for that we use uh, jm colors that add jmi red so jmi red uh, will be added to the jm colors means colors uh, menu in the same way green menu so green item is added to the colors menu blue item is added to the colors menu so after that we are adding colors sub menu to the options menu by using jm options that add jm colors because in this options colors is a sub menu so we are adding sub menu to the main menu options then the next sub menu in the options menu is priority okay so in the in this priority uh we have implemented high and low menu items then we 
added uh, these items uh, to the priority menu finally we have added our priority sub menu to the options menu okay so options uh, the final menu item in the options menu is reset okay so here a new line so that is the jm option that add separator so add separator is used to add a separator means used to add a line which separates the menus which separates the menu items okay so for that we are using j j jm options dot add separator okay we are adding separator in the options menu okay jm options dot add jm i reset okay so after adding the separator we are adding the reset okay so means a line will come after that a reset will come then we are adding jm options to the add so the final menu is help okay students uh, we added about menu item uh, by using jm help that add then we are adding jm beta then we are adding the help menu to the menu bar so jm i open that add action is on this when when we click on open menu item an action event is generated so that is listened by the add action listener method so that's why i open that add action is not this okay so i save that add action is not this in a similar way when we click on the save button an action event is generated so that is listened by this action listener okay so in a similar way all the items used action listener methods okay so finally we are adding uh, menu bar okay by using set j menu bar method on j frame instance okay we are adding menu bar by using j set j menu bar with the help of j frame object then visible to set visible to we know this so main uh, public wired action performed action event so when we click on the item so that item action command string is obtained by using get action command means for example we are clicking on the save so save is obtained by using get action command so that save is stored in str for example we are clicking on the uh, open so that open is obtained by using get action command method and uh, it is saved in str string so in this way each item is obtained each item name is obtained by using get action command and saved in str so for example if we select uh, open item say str equals to open if str dot equals exit so actually str value is open but here exit it compares open with exit open and exit are not same so it cannot enter it cannot come to the system that exit zero so it comes to this line jlab dot set text we are setting the um, text as a label by using jlab dot set text means a label is displayed so open here str is open open selected for example save save selected so if we click on exit then the application is ended okay the application is stopped means we come out of the uh, output okay so we know this this sequence of lines so now look at the uh, output so here java c j menu menu bar menu item dot java compile successfully then java okay students this is our output okay so sam uh, sample menu creation by a srinivasa so here this this is a menu bar okay this is a menu bar and these are the menus file options help we created so file so after clicking file open save close exit these are the menu items okay so here i am clicking on the open open selected okay so just we have described about this uh, statement of save save selected for example options in this option there are sub menus like colors priority okay so colors uh, sub menus having items like red green blue so red red selected okay for example item priority high high selected options colors green green selected 
so and this is this uh, separator as separator so separator is a line this line separates so these menus these menu items and this menu item okay for example reset okay uh, so th this line is a separator exit okay about about sector for example we are clicking on the exit button so the entire program is terminated means the entire uh, window is terminated okay we are clicking on the exit okay so before that close close selected so we checked all the items okay look here then i am clicking on the exit then that uh, termination will occur so terminated successfully so friends uh, this is the important uh, concept uh, in advanced java so uh, look carefully and uh, write this program so here i am showing program so write this program carefully okay okay uh, i will put uh, this program in our whatsapp group thank you